Hey friends, I'm Pastor Joe. Today is Tuesday and I have your word for the day. Have you ever given so much that it hurts? Have you ever sacrificed so much of yourself, maybe for your children, maybe for a spouse, maybe for a coworker, that it actually, actually hurts your heart? Or, or maybe you served on a mission trip and you, you gave of your skin, your flesh, your body. Uh, maybe you served until you couldn't serve anymore. Blisters on your hands and feet, sweat and tears. Have you ever sacrificed for somebody in such a way that you felt a loss? Well, the author of Hebrews tells us about our praise that we ought to offer a sacrifice of praise to God. Hebrews 13, 15 says, Through Him, let us continually offer up a sacrifice of praise to God, that is, the fruit of lips that acknowledge His name. I know sometimes as we gather together for worship, you may not feel like worshiping. Sometimes as you're out in public and you may have an opportunity to lift up the name of Jesus in praise, you may not feel like it. And sometimes it might be all you can do to lift your hand or lift your voice in worship. God calls that, when we do it, a sacrifice of praise. We're offering up something even when it's uncomfortable even when it may hurt, even when it might cost us something. Whether we're in public, we can praise God sacrificially. When we gather together for worship, we can praise God sacrificially. Praise is an acknowledgement that Jesus is Lord and it's on our lips and it's in our hearts and we're able to communicate our hope in Jesus sacrificially to a world around us. We can communicate sacrificially in worship and we can communicate praise in public as we live and work and talk among the people that God has created. His desire is that the name of Jesus be lifted up, that the name of Jesus be mentioned because it's, it is the name of Jesus that can draw all people to God. So as you live your life today, let me encourage you Sacrifice your worship. Be sacrificial in worship, even if it costs you something. God will be glorified, you will be encouraged, and you will be a light to those around you. If today's word for the day has blessed you, like it, share it, or leave a comment. God bless.